Welcome to episode two of Strategic Command World at War, the multiplayer game. Playing with a fellow member of the Wargaming Club for Gentlemen, who is playing as Axis and I'm playing as the Allies, and I'm um, just trying to get my arms around this particular battle. Let's see what he's up to this turn, or this particular game. And uh, he's, uh, of course, first turn, he's crushing me. Which is what the Axis does. Right now. Ouch. <clears throat> yeah, I gotta keep that Air Force going. Made much of a much progress this turn against the the Chinese. We can launch a counteroffensive somewhere in there. Hold on! Don't let him take it! No! already started moving towards uh, France. Ooh, what an ugly turn. Yet again. Now I assume I've got this turn to retake Warsaw, which isn't going to happen. Stiffen French morale in the event of a German invasion. We should maintain a force of no less than two units into France. Better still, five or more units if they can be made available. Deploy these to defend Paris, northeastern France, or the Maginot Line. If we don't do this, French morale is likely to fall rapidement should the Germans invade, and this could lead to a premature surrender. The French are relying us to help them, just as we did in 1940. Let's not let them down. Okay. That's a little optimistic. <clears throat> Red Army deployment in a future conflict. Marshal Stalin and the Stavka have directed and should that should we be attacked, military and naval forces, forces will deploy at the following locations. All land and air units west will be at strength 7, Naval units of strength 10. Northern Front Leningrad. One HQ. Okay, good. Northwestern Front Baltic. One Rifle Corps, Mechanized Corps, one Fighter, one Tactical Bomber. Western Front Bialystok. Southwest. Okay, we got one HQ, two Rifle Corps. Okay, we got some. All right, got it. Southwestern Front Lvov. Two Rifle Corps, two Mech Corps, one Fighter, one Medium Bomber. And reserves. Where are they going to be in? Siberia, Moscow, Stalingrad, Ross, Rostov, two Rifle Corps. Zhukov. All right, got it. What else you got for me? Intelligence report that Mussolini will start mobilizing and should our positions in the Mediterranean appear to be poorly defended. Maintain units at Gibraltar, Malta, Cairo, Tunis, and Damascus. All right, we got a unit. Let's place it. Um, Shoot, what am I going to do with it? Yep, right here. All right, let's start with this front over here. Hmm. Now they seem to be swip. Are they swapping out? Let's see if I've got any type of chance here. That looks like four guys has got to be what? What's three guy core? That's four guys. An army. So they've got an army, army, army. This is a core. Army versus core doesn't work out well for us. Hmm. Lots of rain. Ooh. What's going on with these guys? Get them. Get them. Yes. 
Yes, way to go, allies. I know I took him away from that defensive line, but it is what it is. Let's move him here. Well done, gentlemen. Can't reinforce him because they've attacked. Oh, boy. Let's... Um, we need to reinforce these fellas here. Is it raining up here? Okay, not raining. Keep them coming. Good deal. Hmm. Good defensive position there. Hmm. We got the so we're going to do that just for kicks. Across a river. Good. here no okay yeah we're, we're good right where we are this little reserve core here they're not coming around there so I could move them there I could move them down here can't let them cut off this railroad line here yeah, so far looking okay for for China I mean they're holding out we got a kill that's great we'll take it all right, let's head over to um, Poland and um, our situation there not looking very good. Gone, as a matter of fact. The Poles are uh, no longer in existence. So let's start thinking about Soviet Union here. Minsk. Can we even hold Minsk at the beginning of this? Assuming at some point we're going to fight the Finns, so.
the bowl. Get a Why did every other war game I play the Russians seem to have endless reserves, but now I'm out, now I'm playing them, they don't look like they have anybody. over here good hmm. how much money Soviet's got 174 all right that's what I'm gonna do with that money I'm going to research immediately infantry weapons yes well, basically leaves me with nothing, but I need that going now. France has got 142. forces down there. Destroyer down here. Out of range. Something there for a little trappy poo. French destroyer right there. capital ship right there. I think that's going to do it for French.
How much money does England have? 338. All right, let's do research. Boom. Whoa, what? Oh. We've already got that going. Um. left um, shoot do I need now I can concentrate hopefully I'm getting a little bit better 1276 China 125 which is what the Commonwealth This is Australia. India, Australia, maybe? Yeah. Capital? Yep. Nice. All right, let's take a look and see what we can do here. In terms of research with that, with these guys. We've got infantry weapons going, advanced tanks. Boy, um, these guys are gonna be fighting the Japanese, right? Well, what we, these guys need is um, new unit purchase. How much money we got? One twenty-five. How much are the anti airs? One hundred. Hmm. Good position. British there, British in North Africa. You have thirteen left, huh? Upgrade O Town, okay. All right, you're stuck over here. You're not going to be able to stop the Germans. Yep, that's going to do it for that turn. Anything else? Oh, Canada. Can I bring anything from Canada over? Mm -mm, nothing there. Let's take a look at the big map. Nothing in Canada yet. Got some forces down in here. Hmm. China, USSR. All right, got it. UK. I need more money. I think I've got a few turns. Um, I gotta protect the uh, England, man. Yeah, I'm going to put the BEF up here to fight. Shift some of these French 
core down here core down here and hope hope to fight most of the fight here I can't imagine he's coming through this already all right that's gonna do it for this turn let's end the turn yep yeah the strategy here is yay you got Poland First Lord of Admiralty, Winston Churchill's pressing us first to occupy two ports in Ireland to provide the Royal Navy with bases. Uh, Northern Ireland? Occupy the ports of Cork and Waterford. Nope, we're not going to do that. So we got UK's got 268, which is great. France 128, US 114. China's got 146 up to 206. India's got 33. 25 MPP minus 8 UK. Sending to the UK. Okay, got it. All right. I think that's going to be going off. Appreciate you watching this episode. Episode 2 of the Strategic Command World at War series. We're going to take this one all the way. As long as my opponent wants to play it, we're going to play it. It's going to be fun. Looking forward to it. Hope you enjoyed this episode, and I'll see you on the next one.